There's so many buttons. <laughs> Yeah. What do they do if they hit the wrong button when they're climbing in? Uh, most of the buttons have guards on them to protect from that exact case. Oh, I see. <laughs> and they're uh, they're careful about it. Yes, a lot of these lever locks and things, they're recessed. Then you have to physically pull it up to release it and change the position. These are covered, so you'd have to physically reach in to do something to it. Um, that one you don't have to worry about. These really important ones, SRV separation, you don't want to bump that on ascent if you don't want to have to use it. So these have guards. What is SRB? Solid rocket booster. Those oh. are the big boosters on the side of the vehicle. Are those manually separated? No, no, but you can if you have to. If there's a computer failure and you got to cut these things loose at two and a half minutes, um, you can you leave it on auto or go to manual, pop, and blow them off. Really don't want to have to do that. We've never had to do that, but that's why these are really important. Um, you can. This is uh, cover. external tank. Yes. Same thing. It's in there on auto, or if you really had a bad day, you can set it to manual, and then pop it off. What does this guy do? That's a throttle. Um, the main engines do throttle to prevent overstressing the vehicle on ascent. So, if necessary, um, if again, if we had a computer failure and the, uh, the main engine didn't throttle back properly, the crew could literally throttle back the engines to keep the vehicle from coming apart. 